Hello and welcome back to Caravan Escapades. Thanks for joining us. Um, hope you've found and enjoyed some of our other vlogs. Um, we'll keep making those, so hopefully you'll find them useful. What we'd like to do today is talk to you about leg locks or steady locks. These things, these are little yellow um, locks that go over the winder mechanism on your steady. This is one of various different types. So what we'll do is we'll show you how to fit these, which are relatively straightforward and relatively easy, um, how to fit them and how to use them. So let's take a look at that. Okay, the first thing you'll need is this receptacle. This fits over um, your leg winding bolt mechanism. Uh, it has a small Allen key grub screw in there. I have actually used this one before. This has been fitted to my caravan since we got it. So um, hence the way it looks the way it is. But there's a little grub screw on there. And what that does, that literally just fits over um, the um, winding mechanism. Now, what you do need to do is you do need to um, wind in the Allen key. So this is a little bit more difficult on this one just because of the plastic receptacle. So what we'll do is we'll get the Allen key in there, tighten that off like that. So now that is in there and secure. And really that's it as regarding fitting. What you then do is you take your um, your lock mechanism, put the key in, put it so the lock is protruding, push it on, push the lock in and that is it, that's it, secure. So you can't get on, you can't wind your leg down. Um, the Allen key, if you remember, was there, so um, you can't get the, to the Allen key now to take it off. Uh, the only way you could get this off uh, is cut it off. Now, yes, you could cut it off, yes, you could bash it off, but you can't in any way rotate um, the lock so that the leg comes up or down. So, could you remove it? I'm guessing you probably could if you really tried. Um, but it's just about adding extra bits just to make it a little bit more difficult. Now to remove it, um, it's very simple and easy. Just put the key in, turn it and take it off. So it's as simple as that. So again, key out, push it on, push it on, that's locked home. So that's locked in place to take it off, key in turn it out. Now these are around about the um, 22, 25 pound mark. I'll find a link online and post that for you um, basically in the descriptions below. Um, so yeah, so that's the lock, that's fitting it and that's how to use it. Um, I hope you found that useful. So that was how to fit and use the steady leg lock. Um, how many of these locks have I got? Uh, I've currently got one and we have it fitted on the front offside corner, the non-awning side. I'll probably get another one um, because of the cost uh, and how easy they are to fit and use. So I'll probably get another one. I'll probably fit that on the rear non-awning side. Um, that way we can fit them uh, if we've got an awning fitted as a more of a visual deterrent than anything else uh, that the caravan's secure. Um, if somebody really wanted to get them off with a good bit of effort and um, probably the right tools, I'm sure they could get them off. But if you add that to the um, hitch lock, wheel locks, uh, possibly door locks, um, then it's just about making it the caravan as securely as possible. So we've already reviewed the Alco Premier hitch lock. Um, I've just reviewed the um, steady leg lock. What we'll do in future vlogs is we'll review the wheel locks. I've currently got Milenko Wraith and Alco wheel locks fitted. Two Milenko Wraiths and one Alco hitch lock. So we'll review those in the upcoming months. Um, also, I have a Fiamma um, door lock, security door lock. Um, so I'm going to be fitting that at some point in the future. So I'll record and video that um, and give you my reviews and my experiences on that. So thank you very much for watching once again. This is Caravan Escapades. Please remember to subscribe, like and share and help us keep the channel going uh, and bring more viewers to the channel. See you soon.